Hey, what's going on YouTube? It's Technology Mafia here. Want to do a quick comparison of how quickly the Alienware Alpha starts up using the standard 5400 RPM hard drive versus the SSD that I will be installing. So let's go ahead and I'm gonna grab my phone just to do a timer and what I'll do is I will do the stopwatch and press the button at the same time. So three, two, one. All right. And so you can see on the screen it's starting up. And so that's not focusing, I guess, on both. Focus here. All right, so we are started up. I'm gonna wait for that. Okay, so I'm gonna stop it there. So about 30, 33 seconds um, to start up on the standard um, 5400 RPM hard drive. All right, so we have the Alienware Alpha here connected to the new monitor. I'm going to do the same thing now. This is just with the um, new Evo 850 SSD. I swapped the um, RAM stick back, so this is four gigabytes of memory and um, a swapped out SSD. So here we go. I'm going to do this at the same time. All right. So we're started up there. And I'll go to the screen. Sorry for the glare. So you see the Alienware logo and we're all started. So I'm gonna stop it there. You can see that is 9 point, uh, nine five seconds. So a little under 10 seconds and we're all started up. So um, quite an improvement, about what, uh, a third of the time of the OEM um, hard drive. That's 5400 RPM. So um, definitely recommend upgrading your internal hard drive if you do have one of these Alienware Alphas. Um, it runs amazingly quick once you have the hard drive installed. Um, so anyway, uh, that's the video here. If you guys have any questions or comments, feel free to leave them below. And as always, rate, comment, subscribe. Thanks for watching. Bye.